the middle of November in South Carolina. And if Tom, if you pan over a little bit, you'll see that in November we still have lantana up and you can focus on that candy corn over there. But coal is squeezing in tulips between everything. And one of the places I'm gonna squeeze in some in order to give a layer or a sequencing of bulbs is in this hymenocallus. Oh, hymenocallus. It's a little Thanksgiving tree frog. It's a baby. It's All dividing right. out the hymenocallus a little bit. Taking out just a few of these bulbs. All right. There they are. And then, you know, in another month or so, this hymenocallus is going to get cold damage and go dormant. So it's not gonna be here in the springtime when these people have a big a big party right out in front of their house planned. So what I'm doing is going back into the hymenocallus and layering in tulip bulbs. And we're doing a selection of pink, lavender, and yellow bulbs. And you can do the same thing. In fact, I will do the same thing in a minute with this crinum lily. I'm gonna clean it up a little bit and layer a bunch of tulip bulbs in it so we get this sequence. Spring flowers on the tulips and fall and summer flowers on the hymenocallus, the spider lilies, and the crinum lilies.